Hi, I am Indra. Welcome to my kitchen. Today I'll be showing you how to make curry fish. So let's get started. Let's go over some basic ingredients to make the curried fish. Here I have two scallion chopped, one tomato diced, four tablespoons of curry powder, vegetable oil to fry the fish, one cup of flour, one onion diced, half of a bell pepper diced, three cloves of garlic crush, two tablespoons of green seasoning, some water to mix into the curry powder, one and a half tablespoon of vegetable oil, half a teaspoon of salt, half a teaspoon of black pepper, half a teaspoon of methi seed, four chili peppers, this is optional, and one pack of all-purpose seasoning. See in the next step. Here in my bowl I have six slices of kingfish already washed in some lime juice. Next I'm gonna go ahead and season the fish on both sides with some salt and black pepper. Salt. Black pepper. Next I'm going to go ahead and flour the fish on both sides. Next, let's move on over to the stove to start frying the fish. My pot is on medium heat. I have one and a half cup of vegetable oil heating up. Next, I'm gonna go ahead and add in the fish. You want to fry the fish until they are nice and golden brown. Look at the fish guys, nice and golden brown. So let's get started on currying the fish. Next I'm going to add some water to the curry powder to make a curry paste. This is the consistency you're looking for. My pot is on medium heat. Next I'm going to go ahead and add in the vegetable oil. Next I'm going to add in the methi seed. And you want the methi seed to develop a nice dark brown color. 
the meti seed is ready next I'm gonna go ahead and add in the curry paste Next I'm going to add in the garlic. Onion. And you want your curry to fry for about two minutes. The curry has been frying for about two minutes now. Next I'm going to go ahead and add in the rest of the vegetables. Tomatoes. Peppers. green seasoning Next I'm going to add two cups of boiling water. Next I'm going to add the salt. black pepper all-purpose seasoning chili peppers Next, you're going to boil the vegetables for about 15 minutes. See in the next step. The vegetable has been cooking for about 15 minutes now. Next, I'm going to go ahead and add in the fish. Next I'm going to add in the scallion. Next you want to cook the fish for about 5 minutes. See you in the next step. The fish is done cooking. It looks amazing. I'm going to go ahead and plate it out and show you what it looks like. See you in the next step. There you have it. The curry fish came out really nice and super delicious. You must try this recipe. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up and please subscribe. See you in the next video. Thanks for watching.